everyone. This is Diane from the Body House Chronicles. And today I'm looking at the January 2021 Chronicles. So I wanted to bring your attention to the very lovely Betty Page on this month's cover. There she is with her whip, dressed in her leather. She was known for doing a lot of BDSM photos. A very popular pinup in the 1950s. Men and marriage. She had a few. Here she is again. A sweet little bathing suit that she probably made herself. She was known to be a very good seamstress and made many of her costumes. And Hugh Hefner, the founder of Playboy, uh, said about Betty in 2008 to the Associated Press, I think she was a remarkable lady an iconic figure in pop culture who influenced sexuality, taste and fashion, and someone who had a tremendous impact on our society. She was Miss January 1955, and uh, one of the earliest playmates of the month for Playboy 2. Hmm. She was even named Girl with Perfect Figure by Playboy readers. My, my, my. And there she is. Meow. Oh, more pictures of Betty. Here she is. Now, as you can see, she played both the dominant and the submissive roles, which was actually required by the photographer. Uh, Irving Claw, K-L-A-W, Irving Claw. He was known for doing a lot of BDSM-themed uh, still pictures and videos back in those days. And so it was required by him that his models spend an hour bound up, at least one hour bound up. And then you could do the dominant stuff afterwards. And, oh, oh yes, this I found on YouTube. Let's see. Let's watch a little bit of this. It is fun. Oh, here we go. <laughs> There's Betty, oh my goodness. Wouldn't you like to be woken up like that in the morning? <laughs> okay. <laughs> this is all burlesque and it's all very tame, but it's very sensual and sexy. So I'll let you watch that on YouTube. Oh, and there she is. This actually is one of her most, more famous bathing suits that she made herself. She looks super hot there. Oh, there we go. Here we are. She's very sweet. And yes, here we go. Here's another one. <laughs> this is a fun one. She's dancing around. Let's, uh, let's see what she's doing here. Oh! <laughs> Okay, that's fun. It actually looks like it's been sped up just a tad, but uh, rabbit hole stuff. Oh my goodness. Okay, here we go. Uh, this is the part of the Body House Chronicles where I introduce you to people who are doing very alternative things. Simon Parks is a very interesting man. His mother and grandfather were part of MI5 in the UK. He's also a psychic medium and... Uh, says he's had contact with extraterrestrials. He also is a huge Trump supporter and believes that Trump will stay in office on January 20th. But all his information is there. This gentleman here, Spiro Skouris, is a hardworking alternative journalist who I believe has a regular full-time job. He does this on the side. But he recently got kicked off of Twitter because they just didn't like what he was saying. He was talking about certain information that he had dug up. Twitter didn't like it. And he's now got a lifetime ban. But he is on BitChute. BitChute is hanging on by the skin of their teeth there. Uh, in this documentary, Hope Dies Here. Right, YouTube wouldn't uh, allow this to be played here. And he's got a lot of interesting things to say. Um, yeah, he's digging up a lot of good information. And, oh yes, here is a video uh, by a doctor uh, on new information on vitamin D that I thought was extraordinary. 
Apparently, vitamin D is not just a vitamin, it's a hormone. Thank you for watching and listening and have a very sensual day.